Tesla has just reduced prices for its Model 3 and Model Y by two to five thousand US dollars, or about five to ten percent of the total cars price in China. China is the world's largest car market, and it's very competitive. China makes up close to thirty percent of Tesla's total sales globally. In this video, I'll share whether China's price reduction is good or bad for Tesla investors. Click subscribe to stay updated to more videos on Tesla. Let's deep dive into Tesla's price reduction in China. This morning, Tesla posted on their official Weibo account, announcing the new prices. Their entry-level Model 3 and Model Y rear-wheel drive now start below 300,000 yuan. This is a very important price point to hit in China because of the local new energy vehicle incentives worth 11,000 yuan, which is roughly about 1.5k US dollars. This means that it's going to be a huge catalyst for Tesla's demand in China, especially in Q4 because this new energy vehicle incentive expires on 31st December 2022. Ray for Tesla reported that Tesla China's website is crashing because of very high surges in demand. Personally, I don't see Tesla having a problem hitting at least 450,000 deliveries in Q4 this year. Tesla is making these changes after major upgrades to Giga Shanghai, which sees its production capacity rise to 22,000 cars produced per week, by far the highest of any Tesla factory in the world. Dave Lee also remarked that these price reductions basically revert back all price increases made across 2022 which puts car prices back to 2021 prices in China. To illustrate how compelling these new car prices in China are, here are prices in China compared to Germany, US, and Singapore. As you can see, prices in China are 12% lower than Germany, 25% lower than the US, and close to four times cheaper than Singapore. Car prices in Singapore are very expensive because of high government taxes to reduce car usage. Hopefully, Giga Shanghai will be able to pass back some of its cost savings with export markets. What does Tesla's price reduction in China mean for Tesla investors? For Tesla bears, this is evidence that demand is collapsing. For Tesla bulls, this is a signal that Tesla has gained production efficiencies and is able to pass down cost savings to consumers. In a recent poll, most of you found that this price reduction was good news for Tesla investors. I believe Tesla is making these price reductions from a position of strength. Tesla's operating margins are best in class. Their margins are two times higher the automotive industry and higher than S&P 500 average, which includes many other tech companies. This means that other car companies face the difficult choice of how to respond to Tesla. Apart from BYD, very few other car companies make profits selling EVs. This means they have to decide between reducing prices and face increased losses, or do nothing and see demand decline. Many analysts expect Tesla's operating margin to decline because of this change. If that does happen, it could be a cause for concern for Tesla investors. However, I believe the opposite to be true for a few reasons. Elon has shared that raw material prices are largely declining. Giga Berlin is ramping up, which means lower shipping costs and lower import taxes in Europe. As Giga Austin ramps up, it also contributes more to operating margins compared to Fremont factory. FSD beta is seeing wide release in North America by end of this year, which means more software revenue and higher FSD uptake. If Tesla is able to maintain or even grow operating margins in Q4, that will be a testament to Tesla's strengths. After two years of price increases because of increasing raw material costs as well as limited supply, this is a win for consumers and Tesla's mission of accelerating the world's transition to sustainable energy. Elon has shared earlier that he found Tesla's prices embarrassingly high, and this is a step towards correcting it. For Tesla investors, I see this as a win and strengthens Tesla's lead. If you found this video useful, please click the like button. Hit subscribe to stay updated to more videos on Tesla.